Our top story tonight, officials investigating a boating accident in St. Petersburg. At least two people were injured. Fox 15's Jennifer Veglis is in St. Pete tonight, where several agencies responded to this scary situation. We know FWC is the lead investigator on this incident. Right now, two 15-year-old boys are in the hospital, both in critical condition. It's unclear what led up to the accident in the first place. St. Pete Fire Rescue and St. Pete PD responded to the call around 5.45 p.m. here on Bayshore Boulevard Northeast after the two teens were somehow ejected from a Key West 18-foot center console boat with a single motor. The first teen boy was rushed to all children's and is in critical but stable condition. The second boy was rescued from the water by a bystander. They're also in critical but unstable stable condition. It's unclear right now if either teens were wearing life jackets. The boat wound up about four houses down from where they were ejected from. A second bystander jumped onto the boat, killed the engine and secured the boat. I can tell you that the neighbors came to help. So uh, it was pretty uh, heartfelt to know that that was happening. Any assistance that uh, happens, uh, if it's uh, one of the other agencies that's responding, uh, a bystander that's able to assist, yes, that is obviously very beneficial. Right now, it's unclear who owns this boat, whether it had a kill switch, and if it was used. No one else was on board the boat. Here in Florida, a 15-year-old can operate a boat as long as they have their boater safety ID card. It's unclear right now if either teen has theirs. In St. Pete, Jennifer Vaglis, Fox 13.